This is Chad Smith with Pike County Chamber of Commerce here with Andre Davis with the Dinner Bell, who is our November 2010 Pike County Chamber Business of the Month. Congratulations, Andre. Yes, sir. Uh, what makes the Dinner Bell so special? Food. The food. The food uh, and, and the atmosphere helps too, but it's the food that keeps people coming back. We're famous for our fried eggplant and fried chicken, and they know us far and wide. We have from far away as Australia, we have people come regularly. So. Is that right? It's, it's very, very interesting. Never a dull moment around here. Would you say the majority of your customers you see are local people, or is it a good mix of? I know there's a lot of out of town folks that come would, just here for just for the dinner bell. Probably, probably 80 percent of my business, if not more, is Louisiana. Really? And a lot of they'll, they'll be out at Percy Quinn. They'll see the sign. They'll come here, or they know about it. It's, it's, it's almost a generational thing. We have uh, fathers bringing their kids here, and they're bringing their kids here. So it's it's handed down almost like everything else. There's very few businesses like ours that have been in business for as long as ours has, it's 50 years, and it's a generational thing. That's right. Well, do you know a little bit about the history of the dinner bell you might could share that would make it even more special? The dinner bell has been in this building since 59. Mm -hmm. And uh, the two tables, the two big tables that are in there have been in there, they were assembled in there in 59. They were assembled, or a mill worked in New Orleans, assembled in here in 59. And, uh, there's been a couple of tables added for capacity, but really there's not a whole lot changed. I mean, the building was built in 1920, mm -hmm. so it, it's, it's an old building. If it ain't broke, don't fix it, I guess. That's right. That's right. Well, that, again, there's a lot of history behind it. A lot of people just know the dinner bell. A lot of people, when you're out and about outside Macomb, you mentioned you're from Macomb, and sometimes the first thing they bring up is, hey, I've been to the dinner bell. Well, when I lived in Atlanta, people would ask me where I was from. I'd say Macomb, and they'd say, oh, I know that place. They got the round table there, or you know, they'd know the name of the dinner bell. So even, you know, I was telling him in Seattle, people asked, they heard my accent and, and wanted to know where I was from. and. I said Mississippi, then they said, oh, there's a, there's a restaurant in South Mississippi down there that's got the round tables. And this was long before we ever had it. Right. But I was like, oh yeah, that's the dinner bell. I, even I knew it then. So, right. but, uh, yeah, it, it, we're very fortunate that to be spread far and wide. That's right, that's right. Well, it, it, it means a lot when you have somebody here that's local. A lot of times we have business, we want to try and get a lot of local business a lot of local people here, but it also means a lot when you have somebody that draws people from outside because they might not ever have a reason to come to Pike County other than the dinner bell. And then when we get here, they'll see what Pike County has to offer. Right, well, we, we especially after the storm, we had a lot of people that were our customers that moved here after, you know, they moved here from New Orleans or Louisiana, Slidell, they moved here. Right. Uh, because they were they, they came here a lot, they were familiar with Percy Quinn and us, and so they bought houses here. So now they're local as opposed to being out of town. So that's that, right. That boosted my local business by doing that. Sure, sure. Well, congratulations again. If we can ever do anything for the ch for you at the Chamber, of course, you know to feel free to call us. And if you have any questions about the Chamber or what it would take to get involved or become a member, feel free to call our office at 684-2291.